Good morning. It's Monday, January the 12th, and it is overcast. You can see out the windows, but it's overcast. It's rainy. It's cold. We don't like it. We don't want to leave the house today. <laughs> um, I'm wearing this really, it's like, I guess it's more like a snood because um, it's short and it's like one little neck thing, but it is faux fur and like knit. And I got this, I think two years ago from American Eagle and I love it. And I've got this little, um, it's actually a V-neck sweater on from Loft that I got not long ago, Loft jeans, and then I got some boots from DSW, which are the Audrey Brook brand. I wear wide calf boots and they're my favorite. Um, so I'm about to put on my big old coat and leave for the day. Ugh. Um, so it's Monday, so I'm getting ready. Well, by the time this goes up, obviously it'll already be up, but my vlog from last week, oh my gosh, all weekend long. So I finished filming on Saturday and then, um, <clears throat> Saturday night I started like inputting my footage and editing and it was a lot of stuff so I decided well sorry you can see my finger but my arm is hurting this morning <laughs> it's Monday um, so I decided to wait until yesterday to work on it and it took forever to like save or render or whatever you want to call it and it kept telling me that I had a heap zone error um, in iMovie. Oh my gosh. So, you know, Google that. It tells you 25 things to do. I did everything. <sighs> and finally, I guess overnight it worked. Um, after I took out some of my footage, after I took out some of my editing tools. Um, so yeah, you would have noticed that Tuesday was missing. I only had a little bit of footage from Tuesday. Um, just me in the car being excited about the gas prices that I just gotten. Had to delete all that. Um, I don't know what's going on with that. Uh, I don't know. I just hope I don't have that problem again because when you're on a time crunch, I told Wes, I was like, nobody wants to watch a vlog from the week of, you know, last week in two weeks, you know, because you never know if you need to take it to the Genius Bar or what. But I definitely, I'll tell you this, computer issues make me feel like a non-genius. Makes me feel dumb. I don't like it. <laughs> I get so frustrated. But anyway, um, it is almost eight and I need to give the puppies their pills. Where are you, buddy? Yep, I need to give the puppies their pills. Mm -hmm. He's waiting on me. He's like, lady, hurry the heck up. Um, and then I need to hit the road. So I don't know if I'll come back and film any more later as dreary as it's gonna be. Um, I don't know, we're probably not doing anything, so. Good morning. It is Tuesday, January 13th, and um, it is dark and dreary again outside today. It's why it's kind of shadowy in here. You can see some shadows. Um, yeah, it already started like with its highest temperature, and it's going to work its way down today. I think it's going to be 30 or 32-ish when I leave work today, and I'm like, where is the snow? <laughs> For those of you that have snow, you're probably like, shut up, girl. Um, but I thought I would show you my makeup real quick if I can get a better um, light. Yes, uh, I really like it. And it's not anything really new, I guess, except for my NARS concealer, which I'm trying out. And I still don't know if I think it um, covers well enough. But I'm going to flip the camera around and show you uh, what I'm wearing. Okay, for my face, I'm wearing the Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. And I am in the shade Light Medium Honey. And then I'm trying out the NARS Radiant Concealer today. And this shade is uh, Medium Custard. I like the way it feels. I just need to, um, it's only my second time trying it. I need to pay attention and figure out what I think about it. Uh, and let's see. For my eyes, I did this Be Merry palette by Too Faced. Now this is 2013's Holiday Palette. Um, when I actually used all of these, eggnog, bubbly, brown sugar, buttered rum. Um, I even blended out the crease with this spice, which is supposed to be um, a bronzer. And I used a tiny bit of it as bronzer, and I even used this peachy keen blush. Kept it really, really simple today. Um, went over my face with this Hourglass Ambient Powder. This is Luminous Light. Did I just put a nail in it? Probably. Um, that's what that looks like. I'm using... What's left of my Smashbox Always Sharp Liner, this one is in Sumatra, it's the brown one. And then 
I am still using this Lorac Pro Mascara. This is one of my top mascaras, and I love it. And then for lips, I put on this Dior, let's see, what is it? It's Dior Addict Extreme, and it's in, that's not going to focus, Bon Aventure. Let me take it out for you. Ooh, one-handed. And it looks like this. It's a nice um, kind of bright berry color. And that's what I have. Oh, and on my nails, I finally repainted them. And it's OPI How's It Snowing. It's not a new one, but it is um, kind of a steel gray with a hint of blue uh, glitter polish. It's going to be super fun taking it off, but it sure is pretty. I'm getting ready to leave, and the TV, TV might be up loud because since we have construction out, I like to leave it up loud to help get rid of some of the noise for the dogs. Um, but I wanted to show you my scarf. Um, I got this at the loft <clears throat> right before the holidays, and one side is like that black watch plaid, and the other side is like, oh gosh, what is this? Like Chevron Hound's Toothy? I don't know. <laughs> I knew when I ordered it, it's on the ticket. Um, but I really like it, and I just have it on with a gray sweater. Um, again, I'm in all loft except for my boots are wide calf. DSW, Audrey Brooke and have my staple coat on. I'm getting ready to go start my car and get to moving and get to work for the day. I fixed my bun just a little bit, but I don't really care today, to be honest with you. Between the weather, getting my hair done, and just being tired, this is, this is what it is today. It's Wednesday. <laughs> we got a little bit of ice, and um, she's like, I'm not having it, Mom. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, she doesn't like to get her feet wet. So when it rains, we pretty much have to push her out to go potty. Um, hey, buddy. But yeah, it's just a little slippery. So work is delayed just a tiny bit, um, which is nice. But uh, yeah, just a little bit of ice, nothing. It's pretty slippery I hear on the roads, but uh, I don't know. It's the first winter weather we've gotten, so I always get excited. I just want some snow. So, okay, it is Wednesday, January 14th. I think I just said it was Wednesday, but anyway. Um, you notice my hair is back in a bun. I was supposed to get my hair done yesterday and I ended up canceling my appointment, which I hate to do because I've had that appointment scheduled for two months, but it's okay, it is what it is. Um, I ended up taking Barkley to the vet yesterday, so I was unable to do the vet and get my hair done. So I'm rescheduling that because uh, that is not as important as taking care of my baby. Um, but a lot of you on the last vlog told me about the whole onion thing, which I have to be honest, I know a lot of things that are poisonous to dogs. Um, I've been told a lot of things, I've researched some things, different plants, uh, pork, turkey, grapes, I knew that. Um, had never heard about onions, to be honest, because I guess none of our dogs growing up had ever, I mean, what kind of dog eats an onion is my thought. <laughs> You know, um, but some dogs do and I never knew that they were toxic. So first of all, I appreciate you guys letting me know that um, None of my other dogs have ever even so much as sniffed an onion. Oh, she wants to come in um, Hey poo poo, come on inside. Come on in <laughs> It is cold this morning um, But no uh, when I said he ate a piece of onion, he ate a piece that was probably the size of a nickel. Um, so I talked to the vet and everything, um, and he's 62 pounds, so that probably wouldn't have done anything. Um, but it is something to think about, and I appreciate you guys letting me know because I had never heard that before, um, ever. I can't believe it. I've had dogs all my life. So thank you so, so much, everybody, for letting me know that. Um, I'm definitely not even going to let him get a pea-sized amount of that again. But um, so that was last Thursday when that happened. Um, he had another, like, little shaking incident on Sunday and then one on um, Monday, Monday morning. So we called the vet and uh, we monitored him. Um, took him in yesterday. He's on two types of stomach medication and they couldn't figure out what, what was the cause of it. Um, okay. She ate over, over an hour ago and is still licking the bowl thinking there's something there. <laughs> ah, that piggy. Um, but no, uh, they couldn't figure out, they couldn't pinpoint what was causing his upset tummy. They did um, a urine test, a fecal test, 
Um, they x-rayed his belly. Um, just with his age, there are just a lot more, there are a lot of other precautions. So they did all that stuff. And I'd had a blood work done on him literally, I think, the week before Christmas. Uh, so they don't know. Um, they didn't seem too, too worried, but they wanted me to still monitor his, when he goes outside to go to the bathroom, um, when it becomes normal. <laughs> All fun things that you do for dogs. Um, but yeah, he, I added two more pills. Uh, one to help with the, whatever is going on in his GI system, and the other is to like, just like a settling of, you know, to settle his stomach. Um, sorry, my arms are tired. Uh, so yeah, I just thought I'd update you, but... He seems to be doing okay. I've switched his food now to rice and boiled hamburger. Mm -hmm. When they're sick, uh, our vet says rice and boiled hamburger or rice and boiled chicken. Um, and nothing is as gross as boiling hamburger meat. Let me just tell you, it looks disgusting, um, but it's bland. There's hardly, there's no taste to it. Um, you know, you get the super lean meat. There's no fat to it hardly. And um, that's what he had last night. That's what he had this morning. That's probably why she's like in the bowl because he put a little spoonful on top of her food. <laughs> but so we're going to feed him another night of that stuff and um, see how it goes. And what we'll do is we'll probably, no, we'll probably feed him that again tonight and in the morning take what's left and mix a little bit of food with it. Um, but no shaking this morning. And it just worries me so much because... I don't know, going through what we went through last year with Cooper and both of my dogs are 10, I just can't even, I can't even think about that. And so any of you guys with pets that think you are too paranoid, I mean, same goes with your children. Don't let anyone tell you, oh, don't go to the doctor for this. It's no big deal. Don't go to the vet for this. It's no big deal. You're the mom. You go when you, you know, you have a gut instinct and you go and even if it turns out to be nothing who cares that's what i think sorry that's my little nobody told me not to go or anything i'm just saying <clears throat> i don't know you know what i'm saying but anyway um i'm about to head out for the day i need to go either figure out if i'm going to make my smoothie or get my morning star veggie sausage patties with hot sauce <laughs> that's one of my favorites um but anyway, I thought I would show you quickly what I'm wearing. Um, is that decent light? I guess so. I'm wearing this maroon scarf, a burgundy scarf, which I love. It's super, super soft. It's called um, Collection 18, and it's from Target. No, it's not from Target. It's from Nordstrom, and it wasn't expensive at Nordstrom. And I got me one, and I got my mom one for her birthday, and I think Mindy got her mom one, and we went back to look. They have been long sold out. They're super, super soft. Um, I'm going to wrap it. I'm going to wrap it around. Um, but it's the type of scarf that I wish I'd gotten a couple. Um, I've got the black, this black and white sweater. I mean, cardigan sweater. Hold on. And it kind of has a little drapey like this. And, um, oh, hello. Uh, I got this, I think, last year from Target. And loft jeans, of course. Because loft jeans, I probably have 12 pair of loft jeans. And, yes, the pair that I'm wearing, I have two pair that are identical when I like them I buy them um and then I think you can see these boots right here I hope you can they are North Face I got them at Dick's two Decembers ago when I was going to New York and they were calling for a snowstorm which by the way was super fun to be in New York when there was snow coming down um some people probably would hate that I loved it um but these boots are awesome let me show you again what do you think V I don't know can you guys see those um, you know, they're the boots with the fur. What? Uh, it's too early for that silliness. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to hit the road. And, but yeah, I just wanted to update you about Barkley. And, um, tomorrow my resolutions video is going up, which I hope is okay because I watched it back and it's more just like me talking, <laughs> which when is a video for me, not just me talking. Uh, I liked it, but we'll see how you guys like it. I don't know, I feel a little nervous putting it up because it's pers it's real, I don't know, it's not real personal, but 
I don't know, you, you get some thoughts in my head and sometimes that can be scary. Okay, I'm out. I gotta go brave the cold and um, Wes cleaned off the ice and I don't know if there's been another layer put on, but I need to go take care of that. Baby, how you feeling? You feel okay? You feel better? Mommy take care of you? Hmm? Why your ears bad? Mama takes care of you. Oh, I know she does. Cause she loves you so much. Are you sleepy? You know what time it is? Do you know what time it is? You do. Is it pill time? Hey, B. Is it pill time? Okay, buddy. Pill time? Okay, I decided to go with a smoothie today. I have a neutral bullet and um, I love it. And in here I have some spinach. I have a berry mix. So it has blackberries, blueberries, um, some strawberries. You see a cherry in there. Um, the protein powder I have is uh, it's by the brand Matrix. Um, Matrix Syntax, something like that. Anyway, it's chocolate. So I'm going to put a scoop of that. And then this is some flax seed that I have left over. I have a whole fresh box, but um, I'm going to dump uh, probably half of that in there, add some water, and be out the door. But I just wanted to show you, this is a go-to breakfast for me a lot. I feel good about the berries. Um, they pack a lot of fiber, and of course the spinach, awesome. Uh, so yeah, that's a great breakfast. I forgot to mention that I also added, I have small ice cubes. I had about five ice cubes and a lot of water, probably up to like here. But this is what it looks like when it's done. It, uh, I think it looks good. Um, sometimes it gets a little more brown if I add uh, more more spinach and more protein. But um, if you guys have any super easy and quick smoothie recipes, a lot of recipes I see have all these, I mean, honestly, all these things I'm probably not going to go buy. But um, if you have any easy smoothie recipes, please let me know. Um, yeah, I would love that. Good morning. It's Thursday, January 15th. And look, tiny, tiny bit of snow. It's the little things that I get excited about. It was a dusting overnight, um, and I got excited, even though it's not enough to do anything. Okay, so you saw how excited I got over, like, literally someone went like, Di -di 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 with the snow. Um, I told Mindy I painted my nails, How's It Snowing by OPI, um, because I was hoping to bring the winter weather, and I think it worked. <laughs> uh, I'm getting ready to leave for the day. I'm wearing nothing exciting. Old Navy scarf from last year. A big Old Navy, like, as... Um, what's this called? Fair Isleish sweater. Um, loft jeans, and again, with the North Face snow boots. And why do I wear the snow boots? Is because, well, they're winter boots. They're not, like, sn super snowy boots. But... When do I get to wear them? This is the best opportunity. Yesterday with ice, today with a little bit of snow on the ground. Um, in Virginia, sometimes we don't even wear super, super heavy coats during this time of year. You never know what you're going to get with the weather. Anyway, I'm getting ready to leave. And um, my breakfast this morning, I'm taking with me two little Morning Star sausage patties. And I can't leave without a little bit of hot sauce. Texas Pete. Uh, I cannot eat those without hot sauce. So um, that's what I'm taking with me. And that's it. I might go get my nails done at lunch. I'm not sure. Um, I might try gel because Mindy's been doing gel and they've been lasting so long. And um, I kind of don't want to worry about my nails for a while. So we'll see if I do that on my lunch break. I'm getting ready to leave for work. And this is where she is. You blend into the couch, baby girl. Bye. Bye. I love you. Have a good day. Bye, baby. Have a good day. So he seems to be feeling okay. Keeping an eye on him though, just in case. Oh, you got the spot right here. The windows, you got windows you can look out of. Gonna have a good day. I wish I could pack you up and take you guys with me. Bye. Bye, poo poo. I'm home from work and I'm so thankful to be home. It's Thursday night and um, it seemed like such a long day. Weird, creepy hibiscus right there. <laughs> uh, I've had it for so long, and it stays in the garage. Well, it has stayed in the garage since we moved, right in front of um, a window, so it has lots of light. And then when it got super, super cold, I was like, bring it in. So it's just chilling there until it goes back. Um, 
We need to get a, I need to get a new pot for it. It's in an old, ugly pot. I need a new pot. Um, and figure out a good place for it. Uh, they, the dogs don't usually mess with plants of any sort. Um, Cooper did. Cooper liked to eat leaves. <laughs> um, which was always scary, too. Uh, because everything is bad for dogs. You guys know that. <laughs> um, anyway, off on a tangent. But, uh, what was I saying? I forgot. Um, that it had been a long day, and I'm glad to be home. And, um, sorry, I'm waiting for Wes to get home so we can eat, and then we need to do some straightening up. And I'm going to flip the camera around and show you what I'm talking about. I wasn't going to show you, but since vlogging is real life... I'm going to show you. This is a lot of our Christmas stuff and um, we took it all down and all my ornaments are in this red bag right here which I love these um, things. They're from Brookstone and I think the brand's called Seasons and I I don't know what the brand is. That's what it says on the front. Um, but this is a lot of our stuff and you see it's all kind of just put there because we need to go into the garage and get the tubs and organize and get rid of and see what we're gonna do and blah 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 so yes it's been sitting there for like two weeks so well not all of it it's been collecting for two weeks so there you go um what I want to show you is I want to show you a coffee table um oh see you okay you okay bud you got a piece of rice yeah. see I'm feeling better are you feeling better buddy just had his rice dinner which he loves He's not going to want to go back on that regular food. Are you, buddy? Huh? You're not. Okay. Um, anyway, I think the last time I showed this room, we didn't have this coffee table. We actually ordered it in November. Um, and it was supposed to come in right before Christmas. And, right, like Christmas Eve. And it didn't. Um, it's from, where is it from? Value City. I uh, didn't pay too, too much for it. And it's huge. It's huge, but we love this like wood. Um, it looks distressed a little bit. Um, it's got metal, metal wheels. It's got a layer underneath that you can put stuff. Um, the coolest part is that this actually pops up like you can eat off of it or put your laptop. Um, anyway, my point was it didn't come until like a week ago. So, um, but I wanted to show that to you real quick. And here we are just chilling. I can see Jade's had her tennis ball on the couch. Um, I just brought these downstairs because I washed them and fold, folded them all, and now I need to figure out where I'm going to put them. Um, and, hey girl! Hey girl, hey! What you doing? <laughs> hey, you have to look at your mom. I know. Anyway. Um, so anyway, we're just going to wait here until Wes gets home. I'm going to go change clothes and then get rid of all of that mess right there. Okay, so um, <laughs> I've changed, obviously. My hair has looked like poop all day today. I meant to say that this morning. I dried it last night, and I must have slept like this because I woke up with, like, square head. Do you know what I mean? Where this is all pushed back, and you've got, like, a pretty good right angle here and here. It was terrible. So, anyway, tons of baby hairs. I'm like, um, I was moving some stuff around uh, in the garage because I went and got something to put the wreath wreath in wreath <laughs> what was what was it on the mindy project reese wait what was it reese weather <laughs> do you guys know what i'm talking about when it was the wreath but it was made out of reese i don't know <laughs> reese witherspoon do you know i'm seriously not right um i came across some photos and i thought i'd show them to you they're from our trip to Mexico. Jade, stop licking your paws, baby. Um, they're from our trip to Mexico, which was not this past fall, the one before last. And we did the dolphin adventure and the sea lion adventure. And the, I have to say, I thought the dolphin was going to be my favorite because dolphins are like my favorite, an, one of my favorite animals. And the sea lion experience was amazing. Um, so I'm going to show you some pictures. And Okay, so I had to move towards the light because they wouldn't focus, but that's obviously me with a dolphin. Um, had so much fun. Here's Wes. Um, gosh, that day was so much fun. Um, and I don't remember the dolphins' names that we swam with, um, but they were really, really, really cool. Um, 
This is Cassandra. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just, can you see, hold on. Can you see her face? She is, she was something else. She was insane. She was huge. We kissed in the mouth. Um, some of you might think that's gross, but she was a doll. Look at that picture. Is that not the cutest thing? I wanted to take her home with me. Oh God. So cute. What are you doing? What are you doing? You don't fit. <laughs> Jay, Jay, is that your new seat? Is that your new seat, Thomas? It is. You piggy, you don't fit. Your leg is hanging off. <laughs> She's tripping me out. Oh, but look, Christmas is gone. Oh, so sad. You're crazy. <laughs> Jade, seriously. How long is that going to go on? Jade. <laughs> I'm on 22, three seconds of her doing this with her back fall. It keeps falling off. I don't want to stay up here. What is wrong with you? I don't want to stay up here. You're the strangest dog. <laughs> is she not crazy? You're ridiculous. Poo poo. Give it up, girl. Give it up, big girl. Babe, seriously, it's been a minute. She keeps doing it. Jade, get down. Good morning and happy Friday. It is Friday, January 16th, and I'm getting ready to run out the door. Um, I'm tired today. I know I look really tired. I need to put on my brightener. Um, I put a little concealer on, but I need to put on the pink brightener. Um, my baby hairs are going nuts. I can't, I can't tame them. Can't tame that beast this morning. Um, but quickly, I just wanted to show you two fun things. I'm feeling a little like, meh, today I'm tired. I mean, I'm happy that it's Friday, obviously. But I just feel so tired. Um, I dreamt a lot last night, and I feel like that wore me out. <laughs> Does that ever happen to you guys? Um, but I thought I would have a little fun today, and I'm wearing the um, Chanel Illusion de Ombre in New Moon. Um, you can't get this anymore, I don't think. And not at the counters. Um, Maybe some of you guys have it, but I'm going to get a little close and see if you can see the sparkle. Um, this packs so much sparkle. Uh, so if you have it and you're not a sparkly person, you're not going to like it. Um, that gives me a great shadow across my face. Um, and the next thing is my lipstick. I am wearing, it's a Little Bite Beauty Duo, and um, it is the side in scarlet. It is the poppy scarlet side, and it's the real dark one. But I just put, it's not at full strength. It's just a little bit, and I just blended it in with my finger. Um, something to have a little fun today, uh, since it's Friday, and girlfriend's tired. Uh, hair is back up like this because I didn't wash it again last night, but I'm telling you, sorry. I used nothing like getting just head. Um, I'm sorry, when my hair dries funky, it is a pain. You can't fix it. You just need to rewash it. Um... I don't mean dry as funky. I mean, I had dried it, but I think I explained yesterday, I it must have been still semi-damp or something, and the way I slept was just a hot mess. So anyway, I'm about to run downstairs, give the babies their pills, grab my stuff for the day, and head off. Um, I will say this, uh, I woke up this morning and I was like, what's stinging my eyes? And it was sunlight, because we have sunlight here today. Uh, it should be mostly sunny all day today and tomorrow, which is great because I plan to film a few videos tomorrow. And I'm like, yay, it's sunlight. I feel like we haven't seen the sun hardly at all this week, so um, need that. So anyway, that's it for now. Okay, it is so bright in my house. Look at that. I mean, it's crazy. Where is the right place? Yeah, uh -huh, uh -huh. there we go. It's so bright because the sun's out and it's so great. Wow, my voice just cracked. Um, that makes the world of difference sometimes, doesn't it? Uh, I thought I would quickly show you my not so exciting outfit, but um, 
It's cozy. This is a, uh, it's not the same scarf I wore yesterday. That was from Nordstrom. This is, um, it's a little bit different color even though it's coming off as the same. It's a little more garnet and it's a snood. It's Mossimo. It's old from Target. And then um, I have this like Fair Isle-ish sweater that's cream that I got from um, Old Navy. I have a, just a black long sleeve tee underneath it. I think I've worn a black long sleeve tee just about every day this week under stuff. Um, I have probably five of them. <laughs> Some of, our, some of them are old, some of them are new. Um, I have these gray jeans. They actually zip on the side. They are Kirby from Loft. And then um, ugly black Uggs. And I say ugly because they're busted. They need to be cleaned. But I want to be cozy today. And my office, I'm freezing in my office. So very, very cozy day. Um, I'm getting ready to get the dogs in. They are, if you can... Oh, no, it's too bright. You can't see Barkley through the window. He's staring at me like, lady, let me in. I think I showed this yesterday, but the Christmas stuff is up. We vacuumed. Um, yeah, well, the pillows. I mean, that's just how it is when you have dogs. Pillows stay in a corner so they don't lay on them. And blankets, you know, uh, me a blanket, dog blanket, dog blanket, everywhere. Um, but what we, So what we did last night and why it took us so long to um, put our Christmas stuff away is that we were bringing stuff in from the garage because our garage has still got stuff in it. We don't have cars in it yet. Um, so we were bringing stuff in, reorganizing stuff, seeing what we had, rewrapping stuff, and getting rid of a few things, and then moving the Christmas stuff upstairs to the attic. Uh, in our last house, our attic was a full, the full length of the house, which was fabulous. This house has way more storage, which is amazing, um, but a small attic. So our Christmas stuff fits in the attic, which is great. But... It was a process, and I needed Wes to help me. And um, with Barkley not feeling well this past week, well, not feeling well, but um, I mean, he's feeling, seems to be feeling great now. Um, but he's very, uh, he's a scaredy cat, and he gets spooked, he gets freaked real easily. So we didn't want to bring in all those Christmas tubs, like the big tubs of things, and um, some of the larger things that we have, because he gets scared. And I was like, no, let's just wait. And then waiting turned into like a whole other week. So, um, Anyway, so that's done, and I feel great coming downstairs today, and all that stuff is up, organized in the attic. Yay! I always love these orchids. But I can't keep mine alive. Look how pretty they are. They're just so neat looking. They're so pretty. I just love them. If any of you guys have any orchid tips, please let me know. I'll have to show you mine at some point, if I haven't already. I'm getting a left. Better catch up. The Home Depot. <laughs> it's a big Friday night. Ooh. Home Depot. Ulta, I think I need to pick up one thing. Wow, look at that. I know I look bad, but that's awful lighting. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, might go to Ulta and pick up one thing to review for you guys, if they have it. Um, maybe Barnes & Noble, pick up food, and then home to get in my jammies. Wow, I can't even look at myself. The bags are atrocious. Ulta, 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 yay! There's something in here, a little sneak peek, which you can't see that I'm going to do a first impressions video on soon. Um, I'm waiting outside of Dick's for Wesley. Good morning. It is Saturday. <laughs> hey Jade. What's up girl? <laughs> Jade says good morning too. That's what she does to us every morning right before she needs to eat. Um, She's a howler when she wants something. What do you want? She's, she's just standing there staring at me. Um, scary face. <laughs> oh, gosh. If you're still watching after this mug, um, obviously I just um, took a shower, washed my hair, and I don't know what I'm... I'm going to film videos today. That's what I'm going to do. So today's probably not going to be that exciting for you. But anyway... Hey girl. Hey. Hey girl. Jade. You gonna say hello? Hello. Do I smell good? Do I smell good? 
<laughs> I hope so. I'm clean. <laughs> hey. What's up, girl? Hey. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. No, nothing. Okay. So yeah, so I'm basically gonna film videos today and kind of mess around, maybe do some laundry. Um, I thought we would have a mattress delivery today, but we didn't get the call, which I knew it was hopeful that it would be that by the end of the week, but it's probably next week, and I cannot wait to get it. Um, it's a Wyndham mattress, by the way, W-I-N-N-D-O-M. Someone had asked me about that, and I realized, duh, I didn't even tell you guys. Um, they're made in Hopewell, Virginia, which is kind of funny, because I grew up nearer there, um, kind of near there. And um, they're, I think they're sold everywhere, but it's a great mattress. My parents have had one for 10 years, and it feels good today, just like it did 10 years ago. So anyway, we're waiting because yesterday when we were out running errands and I like went to go get something, like bend down and get something, I could feel my lower back was like, anyway, I can't wait for my new mattress. But after filming videos, my friend Heather and her husband Scott, they're coming to pick us up and we are going to her parents' house for dinner tonight. So I'm excited about that. She has really, really sweet parents, like super sweet. Um, and I just met her dad last month, but I've known her mom for a little while and gotten to be around her. And she is just, they're just the kind of people that you just want to hug on, you know? So anyway, um, yeah, I'll see what I can film Today I might show you, oh I might show you the wine that I bought to take to their house tonight. Before I show you the wine that um, I bought, I will say I'm getting ready to start my morning. I've already had um, like a protein shake. Uh, and I'm getting ready to start my day with some sparkling seltzer water. And I'm just going to put it in one of these like, I think this is an Under Armour. Yeah, it's my husband's. And I like it because it has this little lid and you just, and it pops open and you can drink out of it. Um, it does sweat a little, so that's kind of yuck, but it's okay. So I'm going to do some seltzer water because I want some bubbly and I don't want a soda right now. Um, and I'm going to cut up a couple pieces of lemon and add to it because it just makes it a little less bitter. Um, and then I love um, anything sparkly. So I got a bottle of the Cupcake brand Prosecco. I think it's cute. I've had it before. It's pretty good. That's what I'm... Sorry, you're just getting all up in my fridge. Oh, this is... This is the bottle that I got for them. Um, her parents drink like real fruity wine, she said. So I found this California Crush. It's by Tyler Florence. I didn't know he had wines out. I mean, it's a pink Moscato. So I thought it was fun, a little bit festive. And I know Moscato is like super fruity. Oh my gosh, my refrigerator is totally like screaming at me to close its doors. But I just want to show you guys that. And I need to clean her out. Okay, that's it. That's all you get. Okay, I'm getting ready to film, and I just thought I would keep it real and show you what happens to my desk. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's what happens when you're filming. You're getting ready to film, and you bring everything to you, and you're swatching, and you're playing. Yeah. Hey, guys. So, I just finished filming a couple of videos, and uh, now the lighting looks better. Uh, I say that because I film in the brightest room in my home. It is the brightest room. It's the front of our house. Um, it is so bright when you walk in. And every time I sit down to film, unless it's like 3, 4 o'clock in the afternoon, I struggle with the sunlight. Um, I have lamps on. I don't know. I'm rambling. It just bothers me that I prepare for these videos and I think the lighting still stinks. So I got a gift card to Amazon for Christmas a pretty good sized gift card to Amazon and I think I'm gonna go on and try to order some of those lights that I've seen other people get I hope I'm getting the right thing I need to research it just a little bit more um, <clears throat> I just need something to help me because when I'm doing makeup I want you guys to see what I'm doing and I feel like my lighting is so frustrating it frustrated me in my other house and frustrating me here poop on that um, but I am Getting ready to close down the vlog. Are you sad about that? Poo -poo. Girl sad? Are you sad? She's sad. Um, anyway, uh, one of the videos coming up, I am going to talk about the mascara that I'm wearing. So prepare for that. I have a video on the books 
that I'm going to read this year, um, which they're all over the place, so bear with me if you decide to watch that video. And then I have a video, uh, things I want to finish up this year, which is also all over the place, but a lot of products, and I'm hoping I can get through that. So that is it. Oh my god. Oh, Jade. Um, oh god. If you have dogs, you know why I just got up. Um, she is stanky. <laughs> Maybe that's why we call her poo-poo. Uh, yeah, so I'm getting ready to finish up. Um, I've been filming in this. It's a t-shirt that says Detroit sweatshirt. It says Detroit. Um, and it's just like this heathered gray, well, more like a marbled. Is it marled or marbled? I don't know. Anyway, um, got this from Target. <clears throat> On Instagram, there is two, there are two girls, Target does it again on Instagram, and they show this, and I live for um, a men's sweatshirt from Target. It's a size medium, it's nice and roomy, and I liked it that it said Detroit, and it reminds me of my friend Stephanie, who's from Michigan. She's not from the Detroit area, but it always makes me think of her. Um, and then this necklace, I didn't even, I don't think you got to see this in the videos coming up this week, but it is a fun one. Look at that. Um, it's like the dark um like the hematite looking stuff and then just these pretty jewels and my mom got that after christmas it was on sale at macy's like super duper markdown she got something for her and she picked this up for me i think the brand is guess um but i like it it's just different and i tend to wear a lot of gold things so i like that oh and before i finish see gosh i could tee you guys today i'm telling you um I mentioned that I was going to get a manicure this week, and we ate lunch at our desk. We ran down the street, got a gel manicure. So this is a gel manicure, um, and I don't know the name, the brand. I went for an OPI one that looked like this. They were out. They didn't have it. This is another brand, and I asked, but I didn't. I don't remember what she said, so I'll try to remember next time, but it is a sparkly light gold color, and it looks like a holiday like New Year's Eve, it's very festive, but um, I didn't want nude yet, and I had dark on my nails, and I had red before that, so I wanted something fun, um, and we'll see, I got that done on Wednesday, today's Saturday, they still look fabulous, and I think it's, I'm supposed to get maybe two weeks wear out of gel nails, I've only had gel once before, and I went to Mexico, and the salt, and the sand, and um, all that, it took its toll, so I, this is my first time, like, maybe reviewing what a gel manicure, you know, what I think it does or how long I think it lasts. But anyway, uh, that is all for the vlog today. Bye, Barkley. Say bye, baby. Barkley. Barkley. Uh, yeah. He could care less. He knows his dad's outside and he's like, let me at him. <laughs> anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I am hoping... Whew, I am hoping to do these weekly style vlogs, um, and I just hope that they're not boring for you guys, but I am really enjoying um, doing them, and um, <clears throat> yeah, I guess that's it. So I hope you guys had a great weekend, and I will hopefully see you next week. Bye!